Hello everybody, my name's Chris Unlimited and welcome to Death Road to Canada. This game was suggested to me by one of my followers, so I thought I'd check it out. Now I've loaded it up. I've made a custom character. Uh, I did play the tutorial when I first loaded it just to make sure it would load. Oh, uh, let's see, load. Here's me. I got my red bandana and I thought it'd be hilarious to have a monocle in a zombie apocalypse, so... It was an option and I took it. Uh, as you can see, my name is Chris. I took the mechanic perk because I like to fix things. And I'm a fairly practical person, so. But practical says, you know, you get, you get a couple of plus bonus stats. But then it's like boring personality, which is some people find me boring. So uh, let's go ahead and start. We are on our death road to Canada. Chris, there's rumors that Canada is a safe place, free of the threat of zombies. I mean, it's got to be the maple syrup, right? It's keeping everybody from, from turning into a zombie. With nothing to gain from waiting around Florida. What am I doing in Florida? Heck no. Besides a brave to death road to travel north. Higher shooting skill means better firearm handling with each shot piercing more zombies. Read another hint. That's a hint. Let's hit the road. Oh, we got plus eight food. To start the journey, a group, the group decides to grab some supplies from a nearby location. In order to survive the death road, you'll need to hoard as many supplies as you can. You will also need to find ways to train and grow your team. We have a team. Oh, do we go to the quiet factory? House on the road or y'all mart? You know, I, I've never been. I, I think we should go to y'all mart. They've got everything you need. Who spots some bandit? Y'all mart. Off in the distance, it looks like it's been looted. But maybe there's some untouched loot inside. Your zombie forecast is mild. <laughs> mild with a chance of sluggish in, in the morning. That sounds like me getting out of bed, yes. Uh, go bargain hunting, yes. Uh, oh. Do I want to equip anything? Ah, uh, well, I got a wrench. I got a wrench. Do I need a flashlight? There's me. Elena? Is that, yeah. Sounds about right. Elena, all right, let's, uh, how do we, how do we go? Welcome to y'all, Mart! Let's boogie! whoop ya Yeah, I have... Whoa. Uh, we're gonna need a shopping cart here. Hold on. Gotta get my goods. Get out of my way, zombie! Hey! Gimme, give gimme... Give can I have my cart? No. I need a cart, I'm going to y'all, Mart! <laughs> That's how you use a cart at Yarl Martin. Oh, good God. I did not know what I was getting into. Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that. Get it out of my way. Man, it's like shopping at real Yarl Mart. Get him. Out of my way. I got a discount. Wow. All right, open that door. Hey, anybody back here in the pharmacy? With a loading bin here? Oh, they got a sale on gas and chips. I'll take it. That guy looks extra grabby. I don't. Oh, am I? I'm injured. I think. I don't even know. Oh, watch out, them zombies going. Oh. I didn't even see him. Keep your hands to yourself, sir. I got a femur. I got a femur. Not as good as my wrench. Word. Thank you. I'm a mechanic. Good lord, that guy took some some hits. Oh, 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 there's something down here. 
Captain, I'll take that. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Thank you for shopping at y'all, Mart. Y'all better get going. Get in the car. Get in the car. <laughs> Start the car. Good lord. I was not expecting to have to start the car. I was just like, click and go, right? No! We gotta start the car. Found six food. We're now up to 14. Uh, 38 gas. Good haul. Good haul. Uh, one medical. Good, good. 12 rounds. Good. Found shotgun rounds, no shotgun. 20 zombies destroyed. After a long drive, the group finds a safe place to camp. The night passes with no incidents. The group eats a decent meal. Oh, we lost, okay, four. Why are we eating four? There's only two of Explosives are great until you blow yourself up. That's good advice. The group spies the city from a distance. There's more undead than usual, but it's but it's early in the day, so they should be groggy, at least at first. Uh, yes, yeah, the today's zombie forecast is mild and sluggish in the morning. When driving into a city, the group spots something. Uh, ooh, restaurant. Yes. Eh, it's all get in the car. We're gonna go eat over at Denny's. Anybody need a flashlight? What? See, not knowing what they do, I I wouldn't want to take a flashlight with accidentally. It's 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 buggy. Oh good god, we get abandoned our car. Okay. Where's that famer? I feel like some fast action. There we go. Alright, get out of here. Is this right? Oh, here's something. Oh god, my femur! He broke my- wait, get my- Get my wrench! Hello? Ah, uh, yes, we're here to loot you! Ah, uh, such- Anything in the brick? Nope, okay. I just- that's a pretty good end table. I think I'm going to take it. All right. Hey, we got some um, bullets. And a baseball bat. That's a sturdy Louisville slugger, slugger right there. Yeah. Oh, hey, get out. Get out. Sorry, Elena. <laughs> Didn't mean to hit your duck, girl! <laughs> Alright, we... Uh, yeah, it's in a zombie apocalypse, it's okay not to kill everybody. Do we want a skull? Ooh! Like a cowboy rifle! Yes, that's, that's what I do with a cowboy rifle. I smack people with it. Oh, my stamina in a... We got a zombie point. I have no idea what that does. Okay. Yes! Yes, zombies. Oh, excuse you people. I'm sorry, is this a group? Did you need... Did Grandma need help in the bathroom? Hang on a minute, I'm, I'm... I'm wore out from swinging this thing. Okay. Lovely. Alright, good. Wanna play kickball? It's fun for a minute. Alright. Yeah, this couch looks pretty good. You wanna you wanna load it up in the car? Maybe? Hmm? No? Alright. Alright. The lane is no fun. 
I keep beating till they quit moving. Plus one medical. Thank you. Hang on. Hey, hey, you want to go outside for a minute? I gotta go. It's been a long trip. <laughs> yep. Okay. Hold on. We're hurry to go. Oh, good God! Everybody's here. Elena with me. Good God. Oh, man. Oh, we're gonna die. There's no if, ands, or buts about it. This bat's eventually gonna give out. I know it. Yeah, what I say? Oh, I'm gonna be sad with my wrench conks. Run, Elena! Ah! Oh god, no. No, not like this, no. Oh, give me a minute. Give me a minute, give me a minute. And build up my stamina and then... Woo, I'm sweating. You see that little... Drops of whatever that... Ooh, there's a burger on the grill, yay. Take that! Steamer time! Oh wait, there's a door, quick! Elena, with me! There's absolutely nothing in this bathroom, let's go. Ain't worth di dying for. Although that chair's pretty nice. I'll take the chair. Crap, Let, let's... Loot a house, I guess? I don't know. That restaurant was not worth it. The rest of this neighborhood can... No, I lost my weapon. Good God. Um, maybe? Oh, good Lord, it's dangerous. Get out, let's go, let's go. Here, chew on your buddy's entrails. It worked. Pardon me, buddy. I want to loot your loot your crates here. Whoa! Hey, run, run, later, run. We shut a door? Oh, thank you. We can shut a door. Nice. Um, yeah, let's just shut that back. And do that. And... Oh, so sorry. Didn't mean to interrupt your uh, study time there, buddy. Uh, yeah, let's go. <laughs> Tain't nothing here. Don't hit the car, Elena. Start the car. Glory! Yeah. Eleven food, two medical. Okay, good. Good, good. Yes, good day's work. Yes, yes, good day's work. Both happy. Um, The group finds a trash house with some bottles and tattered rags. Searching it seems like a waste of time, but Chris has an idea. Ah, oh, me. Yes, me. What is my idea? I can take the bottles with them to throw at zombies and other enemies. Chris's wit revealed. Oh no. Oh, that Chris. Oh, oh, that's it, game. I'm insulted. I'm I'm insulted. My wit is revealed as, as a sad, frowny purple face. Take the take the bottles. Take six empty bottles with them. They might come in handy. Yes. Who's gas? Group camps for a night off a quiet stretch of the road. The group eats a decent meal. In the morning, there's a moose outside the camp. Looks injured that it just glared at the group. Even injured, a moose is a really powerful creature, probably best to not mess with them. Yes, definitely. Treat the injury? Wrestles the moose? Shoots? I mean, we got guns. 
we found a hunting rifle. We could technically bring it down. See, here's the thing. In a game, I may, like, be nice and treat an injury. I would shoot a moose. Definitely ain't gonna wrestle him. Uh, but in real life, no, leave it alone. I don't care how how injured it is. Those things are huge. And they will mess you up. Uh, we were doing okay on food. It's gonna be a mistake, but because it's a game, I gotta try. Chris tries to help the injured moose. He doesn't know much about caring for a moose and ends up angering it. Moose flings out a hard kick to Chris. Ah, uh, yeah, see, see, leave him alone. Should have went with my instinct. Leave him alone. Chris morale decreases. I went from that to <laughs> broken rib. <laughs> Chris is hurt. Oh, God. Yeah, I got it. Chris's medical, med medical revealed. Oh, no, I'm sad. God, I'm, I'm coming out of. You know, we might make it to Canada, but everybody's going to find out I'm an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, I'm fully healed. Really feel Chris really feels that he has to sneeze. This feeling drags on, but there's no sneeze. This may turn into one of those times the sneeze is lost. Combined with the pressure of this apocalypse, this could break Chris's morale. Oh no! My morale, which was already low from wrestling, trying to heal a moose that didn't heal. Smash self a nose? No. Snort spicy food? No, just, just. Okay, I'm gonna break, I'm gonna, I'm gonna chance it. Try to sneeze. Chris can't sneeze on command. He loses his sneeze. It's very annoying. Chris's morale has decreased. Oh, I can't sneeze. <laughs> oh god. All right, look, whoever what did you get me into? Whoever said this game. I could sure go for anything else right now. Uh Outside of Canada, most of the societies and civilization had been destroyed. You can still find people engaging in trade with preserved food being the new currency. You have 17 food left. A group runs into a trading camp. Uh, let, let, let's visit. Uh, hello? Uh, yes, do you have, uh... Hello there? Finn is tired of being stuck in this camp. He will join you for a small fee of five food. Um, do we need him, though? Oh, is he a field medic? Finn claims to be experienced in medical matters. He nearly admits that he wasn't a doctor, doctor, but catches himself. Uh, leave, leave for now. Hold on. Who are you? Group sees a man standing near an SUV. Do you have any spare gas? I'm running out. He offers to give you two cans of food for every 25 units of gas you... You have grade 50 gas, grade 25 gas. Uh, I'll give you 25. Why is there a skeleton? Group trade 25 units of gas for two food. Yep. Okay. I don't like it when I make a choice and it's like death. Hey, yeah, you doing this? Um, I was just trying to talk to you. Should we take the medic? Uh, sure. Devours the food. <laughs> Flynn joins the team. Onward to Canada. Oh, Canada. Fire is very welcoming. The group could stay in this camp for a day. Rest and check wounds. If you can spare the time and food. <laughs> no time to rest. Uh, we gotta get on the road, dude. What's in here? Oh, hello there. Group sees a woman standing near a stockpile of crates. The crates seem to contain a large amount of food and drink. I got food! I'm looking for some great weapons! 
We kind of need those. Takes a quick look at what Chris is carrying. Sell a cowboy rifle for one one food? Heck no. I haven't even shot any zombies with it. Always ready to rock. I see. Oh, good. What the? Oh, we got to check this guy out. What the heck is going on here? It's an old but fit man in matching gray sweatpants and sweatshirt. He screams something about building mass and bulk with an intense strength routine. He flails towards some heavy objects lying around. Do you have 14 food left? Why did that matter with my food? <laughs> oh, hey. I could get, uh. Yeah, let's do six for training. Who should get the training? Uh, me. Because <laughs> I'm an idiot. Gets all pumped up from the strength training. Yay! Strength. <laughs> is revealed that my strength is sad. <laughs> Chris's strength increased from sad to... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good thing I did that. I'm a very sad... I live a very sad existence here. Mm. Hello. You meet a strange and menacing figure wearing a mask and a robe. I sell axes, just axes. You have eight food left. Tells it to cool it. Fire axe. Ooh, hatchet for three. Um, I think we'll just leave for right now. Man, it's getting several shotguns. Shot, no, let's go. All right, I, I, I get it. We got weapons, we got... We, we have a limited food supply, that's... Uh, I'm gonna guess you sell bazookas. Oh, a wizard! Uh, hello, sir. I am a wizard, I can foresee your future. I'll reveal hidden truths within the power of your tarot. You have eight food left, give. Terror, eh, one food, what the heck. You will refuse helping someone in need and the fates will punish you by making you die a terrible death. That sounds, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Morale decreases. <laughs> Finn resolved to defy fate. Finn, max health and luck. It's like, oh yeah, old man, I'll show you. Hey, Finn, we should all be, we should all be that, that good, right? All right, hop in the car. Here we go. Floor it. I like that. There is no, like, gently walk away. No, floor it. <laughs> Should have been a prepper. The group opens the doors to a tea shop and finds a very fancy dressed woman inside. Where? We're on the road. Casually comparing two boxes of tea. She puts the boxes down, turns half to you, and picks up her umbrella. Can it recruit her or leave her? I, I don't know. She has an umbrella and a penchant for tea. She seems a bit proper for us. Hmm. I might regret this, but I'm gonna leave her. Leave her be. She's, you know what? You're, you're busy with your tea. It's fine. Lacks enough medical supply. I don't want to go to Canada. It's too cold. Uh, where do you think we were going, Flynn? Crew's about to explore a small house when notice that a horde is creeping nearby. The group will have to hold their ground for a bit before they can escape. Siege alert. There's no escape. Horde size moderate, current time near noon. No! Oh, good. Okay, hold up. Hold up. What do I got? I got the cowboy rifle. Mm, what do you got? Take a bottle. Take six. I don't. You got a rusty machete. Huh. 
<laughs> Here we go. Oh, he's got my wrench. Aiming on this is terrible. All right, hold up, people. Grab some chairs. Get to checking. <laughs> hey, that guy's pretty good with a machete. Siege is over. You can now try to escape. Okay. Hold on. Let me get my wrench. Hmm. Try to save on bullets. Uh, hey, Mr. Machete Man, you want to lend a hand here? You want to leave this location? Yes. 33 zombies destroyed. Yeah, dude, just stay, keep going in the car. Uh, 10 gas. Oh, we need gas. Crew feels inspired after managing to survive that situation. They feel like they are getting the hang of this. Choose a reward for the group. Morale and random skill gain. One health healed. Flynn plus two strength. Uh, every day is a great teacher. As long as you don't get eaten. Hey, my morale's increased. Everybody's morale increased. Yay. Fitness increased. Strength increased. Medical increased. Zombie points earned. Recharge some more in title screen. Okay. Then help us on the run. <laughs> we need gas. Resting before a brutal day tomorrow. The groupie. Okay. Just go to sleep. We don't need scary stories. <laughs> 